everyone show some reverence for Imperium. One of the most disciplined groups WWE has ever seen. Looking ready to dish out some punishment. The following contest is a six-man tag team match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 737 pounds, Ludwig Kaiser, Giovanni Vinci, and Gunter Imperium. Imperium is steadfast in their belief that the ring is sacred, that it must be protected from those who aren't true wrestlers. They harshly judge anyone who would claim to be as good as them, and their noses couldn't be any higher in the air. Now, well, maybe some superstars deserve to be looked down on. Maybe not everyone is as good as Imperium. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, there's a superiority complex there, Corey. And then there's whatever Imperium has going on. Precision offense, incredible in-ring skill. That's the calling card of Imperium. And it is one that has brought them Time to party with the Prophets. Combined weight of 492 pounds. Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, the Street Profits. Byron with the Street Profits out here. I can't even get mad at you. <laughs> All right, Michael, high five. All right, maybe not. We are living in the almighty era. And from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. We've seen it so many times when that bell rings, Bobby Lashley flips a switch. And on display, we witness his frightening intensity. I mean, fright. And here we go with tag team rules in effect. Getting underway, we have Gunther, Ludwig Kaiser, and Giovanni Vinci. But they will be facing some fierce tag team action with Montez Ford, Angelo Dawkins, and Bobby Lashley. Flying. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. God. Into the corner. This can't be good. He thinks he has it. No, he kicks out. Not even a near fall there. Oh, look at just... Oh, what a nasty, nasty move. Oh, headlock takeover. That's got to be demoralizing. Being thrown around like that by a superstar a fraction of your size? Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Saw that one coming. Splash! That was that chemistry you cannot teach. In a six-man tag match like this, what's the best strategy for each side to take? You have to avoid bad matchups. You've got to pick your targets carefully and not let yourself get tangled up with a guy who's got your number. Quick thinking from Lashley. 
clothesline. Gunther didn't look too comfortable there. Lashley put some serious hurt on that one. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. Elbow drop. Piercing. Oh, my gosh. That don't stop anybody. It's been a long time since the Monday Night Wars, but Raw has not slowed down since. And as far as I can see, there's no end in sight for the Red Brand. Oh. Oh. Lashley is laying siege. And Lashley is carefully calculating every movement. Using the elbow to escape the attack. mix of pure power and bad intentions. Oh, what a right hook. And he sends him into the corner. Who the forearm connects. Montez Ford with a strategically placed shot. And he saw that coming from Montez. He turns it around. just has that swagger face first. And Giovanni's resolve might be wavering here. Vinci's not showing any capacity to fight back. Oh, got the knees up. Could be a big turnaround here. Ooh, point of the elbow counters that. Float up. Uh-oh. Shot to the gut will break things up. This is just brute power. Release German. That turns it around for Montez. Close line. Oh, ouch. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Ah, stop. Boom, disabling the. We got a cover. Kicks out. He still has life. And you gotta think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Boom, what a forearm. Ran right through that close line. Wow. What impact! Get this straight. Incredible power slam. Does he get it here? Instantly, he has his shoulders up. What stamina. It's truly impressive to completely beat the count here. Oh, my. What a display of dominance. Vertical suplex into a
Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Intercepts that attack with a knee right to the stomach. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. We go free. From behind. Chop block. The close of this match is just ahead. Holding on by a thread, maybe even less at this point. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Uh-oh. Face for a turnbuckle. In off the tag. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh. Steps through, double underhook into the neck breaker. That could have Kaiser right now. Oh. Ooh, man, for the win. Kick out. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Hooking it up here. What's next? Before the refs count. How'd he do that? Close the the back of the neck. Ludwig Kaiser is sending a clear message here. Tag made. Tag made. Oh man, he is more than fired up right now. Oh! And the hits to the core keep coming. Oh, oh he knew what was coming. Ludwig gets out of the way. Face gouge! Oh, God! Oh, man! Catches the kick! Into a dragon screw leg whip! These guys gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. Here are your winners. The team of Montez Ford, Angelo Douglas, and Bobby Lashley. Big win for these three here tonight. This is what it's all about. All the hard work, all the training, it's all for achieving big victories like this one. The face that runs the place is in the building. And he is ready to stand head and shoulders above the competition once again. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the greatest of all time, John Cena! When John...
Mello is money. money from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. Look, I have to admit, I hold Mello in very high regard. His impressive ascension has been nothing short of meteoric. Multiple title wins, main event matches. This young man has quickly done it all. With no signs of slowing down any... Oh, this is my favorite part. He's going to sing. Y'all know what time it is. Oh, boy, here we go. Tag team matchup underway. There is a tremendous amount of trust that goes with being a tag team. Your future is not only in your hands, but in the hands of your partner as well. That's something to keep in mind during this one. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Miz gets out of the way. Ooh. A running Hurricane Rana. Now, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. at this moment, guys. Yeah, the Miz was clearly laser focused there. <laughs> what impact! Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Stiff forearm shot. Oh, nothing fancy with that boot. He takes control. is so important in a match like this. Tag team is on the docket. The mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners. The team of R-Truth and the Miz. R-Truth closes the door for the team. Put that match in a museum or a textbook so future teams can study to learn this craft.
Starting things off with Zoe Stark, a woman who really embodies, in my view, the term fighting spirit. Zoe Stark has a hell of a pre-WWE resume. She's been tapped as one to watch by all her trainers, and she's completed a year-long rehab ahead of schedule. If there's an obstacle, safe to say she can, will, and has found her way past it. Perhaps she'll overcome an obstacle again here. And then we've got Alexa Bliss. I said this numerous times. Alexa has rediscovered that urgency, that aggression that helped her climb to the top before. Absolutely, Corey. Just look at Alexa's eyes, and you can see the determination. And just a hint of something sinister, too. Zoe Stark's still a relative newcomer here in WWE. So what does she need to do to get people's attention in this match? Every match is an opportunity to show the world what you can do, and Zoe Stark can do a lot. She's a wealth of knowledge, and you can tell by what she does in the ring. Don't just lean on one skill. Lean on all of them. Not a forearm! And Stark hung tough, but that looked like it took a toll. Yeah, that is Bliss showing just how dangerous she can be. She's got to be careful here. The referee will count her out. She throws her back in. Boom! Drop kick from behind! And she dodged that one nicely. Larian! Boom! Oh! Axe handle! Out. Alexa carrying the momentum of this match. Zoe has to wake herself up and turn her intensity up a notch. Couple of clotheslines. Well placed kick right to the face. And two from the goddess with insult to injury. From the top. She's going up! Top rope here! <laughs> Hung out to dry! Stark can't stop this string of offense. Looking to create... Alexa! You gotta be kidding me! Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. And gets tossed back into the mat. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. Here is your winner, Alexa Bliss. And that... Well, the great one has arrived. It's check-in time at the SmackDown Hotel. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida. Weighing in at 275 pounds, The Rock! Oh, oh, oh. Are you guys ready? And his opponent from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 245 pounds. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. Oh, this person better be ready to go because he's going toe-to-toe -to -toe with one of the all-time greats, The Rock. And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overlooked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. My goodness, I hope he's ready to go one-on-one -on -one with the great one because The Rock is primed and ready to put boots to, well, you know what. Well, it's reasonable to think that's in his very near future, Byron. It's tough to bet against The Rock. Oh, what a punch. Muay Thai clinch. 
and a series of vicious knee strikes to the body. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Ah, oh, foot right in the throat. Brutal. Suplex. Suplex. Oh. Here it comes. Nicely done. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Thrown back in under the ropes. Up they go! That'll jam your tailbone. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fake. And breaks out of the sleeper. Ooh, clothesline delivered. Corey, any ideas on what type of strategy The Rock should employ in this one? Once again, Cole, I'm going to defer to a wise man's old saying. Don't fix what ain't broke. The Rock doesn't need any advice from me. All he needs to do is keep giving the people a show, and I think that should basically do the trick. He climbs into the ring. Clothesline! Going right after the neck. Neck breaker! His shoulders are down. Kicks out at just one. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Denied with an elbow. Top of that turnbuckle is not where you want to be. What on earth do they have planned now? This has been such a physical battle. And now from the top, gut wrench suplex. A move from that height could rearrange your bones. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! There won't be any coming back for The Rock now. And he's still in the game. Just got the hairs on their arms raised as the most electrifying man in all of entertainment is still in this. I thought it was over. The WWE Universe thought it was over. But you got to do a little more to finally finish this. Now in belly. He's lost some of his win now. Yeah, The Rock is already electrifying the WWE Universe in this one. So hopefully, this will be a short trip outside. Hammering down on the knee. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, as this match goes on, he's learning exactly what it feels like to run into a Brahma Bull. Big four. Short grove line hits its mark. Stop after stop after stop. Oh, that'll shatter your chest. To the jaw. 
Fireman's carry. Up and... Now let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner. An unexpected loss for The Rock here tonight. It's a good thing The Rock has a second career in Hollywood because he didn't look ring ready tonight.